today uh money was like oh well, uh what are you gonna do and i was like i don't know what are you gonna do he's like i'm seeing zootopia and i was like oh cool tell me how it is and then he looked me straight in the eye and he says i know for a fact it's going to be great <laughs> Is it Batman v Superman or Batman versus Batman v oh. Superman is a court case <laughs> <laughs> where Superman wins. Yeah, I was so mad when it turned out to be an action movie. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, where's that good court drama we've all been waiting for? <laughs> where's Starting Batman, Batman and, and then Superman. Batman stands up and says, I'll, I'll speak for myself. And everyone in the crowd just gasps. For real yeah. though, I'd, but like, I'd gobble Bruce, that film up. <laughs> Bruce Wayne is a, Batman's attorney, yeah. and they're never in the same room. With the, in the a same, court same drama, time. like a Supreme Court drama with Batman <laughs> and, and it's Superman. Great because people I'd keep watch calling Clint, out of that. Clint and Bruce Wayne up to the stand. Oh. And <laughs> like, I need to go to the bathroom, and then they just rush out and quickly like, change it. Oh man, yeah, <laughs> that'd be great. <laughs> I want Batman versus Batman where he has to fight with his own inner demon. I want Batman versus Batman and he has to fight a black Batman. I want no, no, no deeper meaning. I want Batman versus Booperman. <laughs> <laughs> Just because I like the word Booperman. Spectacular, up spectacular Spider-Man. The lyrics were pretty simple. Well, you know. But it got the point across. Yeah. And yeah, there's like definitely a huge greek presence the ethnicity not the <laughs> fraternities and sororities I was about to say there are no fraternities. Just, i just hate greek people. i was about to say mm. um, mm -hmm. but i will now perform an interpretive dance of how i feel okay oh my god he's doing a backflip <laughs> He's not moving at all. It didn't take. He's not moving at all. Greg you broke his rib talking? cage. Oh my god. I'm taking off his mask. Are you guys seeing something different? Because Greg's definitely just sitting there. Greg was Timothy Snyder the whole time. God, I should start keeping the dream journal. Yo, no, it's great. I, I should start implementing your dream journal. <laughs> Specifically with Tila being a white supremacist. Make him watch the Rogue One trailer. Trailer, sorry. The what? Rogue One trailer. No, you said Rogue. I one? did. I did. And that's silly sound. Man. It is you, pretty embarrassing. You're a dumb idiot. I am. <laughs> um, Greg is really the unsung we... hero of this. Greg runs whole this shit. But, yeah. I mean, yeah, definitely. Um, but I also feel like I sort of get paid in the um, passive aggressive ways that I describe you guys on the show. <laughs> Like, yeah, do you like remember that one story? DJ Sushi Scammer? Yeah, fuck yeah. you. Fuck you. Uh, DJ and, like, Visual Humor. Where, uh, Aiden, I like that one. I like that Aiden, one. Aiden uh, wanted his story removed. Um, and so it's a recording of my roommate, like, instead of it, just saying, like, Aiden didn't want his story told. So fuck him. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and that's it. Yeah. Um, I don't remember that. But, you know, I, I feel like that's, that's, uh, because I, you know, I enjoy the process, but then I also get to, you know, just diss us. Yeah. Wait, Connor, you're gonna be like out of my life in like a month. I might be like back you. in your life later. Yeah, I don't care as much. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> Greg, I want you to know that I very much appreciate you doing all the editing work and the uploading stuff. I'm happy that these are documented. Um, to take me down memory lane when I'm 50 and I need something to jerk off to. I was gonna say that. Um, <laughs> But then I didn't want to. Yeah, the reason but I, everyone I, heard it. Everyone heard it I without took, me saying the it. The reason you know? I took so long trying to say the blasting off in the poop rocket was because I could. I kept thinking jerking off. In the <laughs> jerking poop. off in the poop rocket. Uh, Don't that's... touch it again. Oh my god, you touched it again. So gross. He's talking about his succulents. <laughs> <laughs> succulents. And yeah. tweet at us <laughs> at FNBS well, Radio. Hold on. E email us at. Or preferably okay. email us. Thank you. Yeah. At fnbsradio at gmail.com. Yeah, I didn't write, I didn't like <laughs> process how boring that was until you pointed that out. Thank you, Greg. Like, we're literally just listening to Okay, let's, let's, let's make it. Okay. okay. Oh, what's this? Who's entering the room? It's presidential candidate Timothy Bernie Lass Sanders. Yo, what's up? <laughs> I know I'm a comedy genius, uh -huh. but we all have mitts. Okay. Uh, mi mitts. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking gold, though. Does I anyone have a that. nightmare that they're naked, but no one's around to see? <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was quite a sustained guffaw you got out of time. Oh, man. Oh, oh opium? I want that. Oh, is that what turns your skin orange? 
No. That's carrots. <laughs> I yeah, cool also drinks. I had trouble um, smelling. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard yeah. stories about people who die and they just get like really scared at the very, at end. The very end. Yeah, they're just like, oh no, I'm <laughs> dying. I had a dream where I got my girlfriend pregnant, but it was the opposite of that. It was like a heist movie. <laughs> like, <laughs> she's pregnant. But there's like there's I need this to steal the Declaration thing. of Independence. <laughs> it was like there's this like special item I can steal, and I I can if I take it in like four hours, she like magically won't be pregnant again. Mm. That's great. Mm. Plan B. Uh, plan B. It was this, Is yeah, it was the essentially plot to, like, plan Looney B. Tunes back in action. <laughs> yes. It was, yeah. Greg, yeah, the answer to that cars. question is always yes. <laughs> The Primo, thing is, is that like, Primavera. Oh, your jeans. I want to put them in my <laughs> pasta pie. Put in a spicy meatball and. <laughs> Connor, you know that humor works. is so good. Thank you. That's my favorite humor. Let's just let's just make Italian jokes forever, Carolyn. I think <laughs> we can agree on that. Yeah. And it was, it was like philosophy, philosophy in Italy, and I was like, Why, Why the meatballs so spicy? spicy. <laughs> Oh. And so I was in my house freaking out. Yeah. The assassins come. They just knock on the door, and I give up. And I let them in. Oh man. And they, they're like jokingly condescending and stuff. And I'm like, whatever, I don't care. Rude. And they bring me to the kitchen. They put me on my knees, and they put the gun in my mouth. But they put the gun in the wrong way. <laughs> so <laughs> so I shot, shot them with the tongue. <laughs> <laughs> no. But um, so I start sobbing in my dream mm -hmm. and I'm begging them. I'm saying, please let me text my best friend, Victoria. Please let me tell her how much I love her. OK. And, and how. Fine. Yeah. And, and like text us. <laughs> yeah. No, I was like, please. in my head, text I was like, Victoria and tell her to text me. <laughs> she, she loves Give me. it a shot with Greg. <laughs> but yeah, that would have been a much different dream if I was like, wait, let me text Friday night Bible studies. And I just sent you guys the middle finger emoji. <laughs> And I was like, all right, I welcome death with open arms. You text us all like, I just want you guys to know, you know, like how much I appreciate you all. And just like, <laughs> and Con like yeah, Connor like, just like immediately sends like a thumbs up. And then, like, <laughs> Aiden, Aiden sends like a middle finger and I just write K. Uh, you know what's art? This right now. Ah! How do you pronounce share? Because I was going through my dream journal. Um, a couple days ago. Shut up. You just did the, what's so the number funny. for 911? <laughs> I had I had turned in my final screenwriting script for Screenwriting 198 for my class. But to my dismay, I had re I realized that I had replaced several key scenes in dialogue <laughs> with share lyrics. <laughs> So, what did we learn today, guys? Um, Dream Me is the most articulate person I've ever met. Um, two interesting things happened within three months of each other. Yeah, I learned that Jay Bindo is going to take me on a nice date. Uh, and I learned that I need to smoke crack, or as Connor would say, crack. Yo, I'm gonna change the crack game. I'm gonna sell crack to kindergartners. It's sad, it's sad. Yeah, suck my dick, suck, suck my dick. Oh, hey, mommy, I make lots of money. Gonna get real high on crack, hey. You're in the crack game. Put it in the pipe and ah. Smoke the crack. Do you ever like think that you you peed your pants and so like you, you touch your pants? Oh, when but, like, I'm drunk. You don't know if it's if it's wet or if it's not because you sort of forget what the concept of wetness is. No, my hands are not that when, wet. <laughs> when, I'm, when I'm inebriated, me either. I don't know. When I'm inebriated, I have to stare at my crotch for like five minutes to confirm that I did not pee my pants. I do too because I'm just amazed at how <laughs> large my genitals are. <laughs> All right, should we? So anyway, mo, 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 mo. this has been Friday Night Bible Studies. Thank, Thank you, you for, for joining us on this extra special episode. Uh-oh! Because it went really long. Now it's oh, Saturday morning. No. Praise the Lord. Good night. That's not what my mom... <laughs>